How's it going, everyone? Jerry's here to Mobile 4. Uh, in the last episode, we unlocked Zeus, as you can see. Uh, we also unlocked Jia Chong, Munanori Agyu. Uh, the next mission wants me to use these characters, minus Wang Yi, of course. Um, but they wanted me to use Lu Ling Chi, and she's in training right now, so I figured, you know, I'll replace a badass woman with another badass woman. I uh, can't use Jurong all the time, yeah, or Chun Hua, yeah. So anyway, before we uh, get crazy, let's go ahead, because um, I did say last episode that I wanted to check out his new magic. We're just going to see the spammable and the charge magic, and that's more or less it. And that's and then we'll just get straight into the battle. Um, if you guys missed out on seeing Zeus's attacks, um, uh, I did show him on last episode for a good portion of the video, too. I think I spent a good like 10 minutes just on him or something like that. So, uh, the spammable. Let's take a look at the spammable. So spammable, pretty cool. Alright, I don't mind the spammable on this. I kind of like the spammable on his regular magic and on this one as well. Kind of like them both. Spammable's good. Right, I must say, I like, I like it. So, let's go ahead and check out the uh, charge magic as soon as more babies spawn. What in tarnation is this? So, okay, so... What is going on? Why, what was it? Wait, what? I don't even know what happened. Alright, so... Let's go do this again. Okay, it's one of those spammable ones. And then the last one you throw it on, you're supposed to teleport to it. But I was uh, a little confused there because it didn't look like I teleported. Let's try this again. And then on the fourth one, he'll teleport to that one, yeah? Okay. So what ended up happening, uh, why it looked funky, not really a fan of the charge magic, by the way. Uh, so what ended up happening was over here, I tried to port to this one, and I get... Oh, it worked this time, so that was weird. Okay. So, this magic, not bad. Um, if I had to pick between this and the regular magic... Ugh, kind of, kind of a difficult decision. I think I'm going to go with the other one, the original magic, just because I get a guaranteed uh, electrification on myself. And if you guys are confused about what I'm talking about, you can check out last episode, or you can just watch this battle, because we're about to rock out in this battle right now, too. So let's go ahead and uh, jump back to camp and get ready for, uh, get ready for some combat. Ah, uh, yes. I'm going to put the old magic on because I like the fact that when I electrocute myself, um, I uh, empower all of my abilities. And that charge magic, I feel, is much superior to this one. This one just looks like a copy-paste of other magic we've seen. Just this one's with electricity. Big whoop. So this one's actually, the original magic is actually, in my opinion, superior. Um, so we've got the uh, DLC Monir, we've got the DLC Hades. And we've got the regular uh, Kiranos um, weapons. This is what we're packing on each of the characters. Nothing too crazy. I went for Brawn and Reach on her just because. Maybe the Reach is a bad idea because that's more of a single target weapon she's got on. Uh, we'll find out if I regret that soon. And Ice and Wind because he's got Brilliance and he's going to have both Ice and Wind going off all the time. Um, as long as he has Muso Meter, of course. Uh, what else do we have? Costumes. Oh yeah, she's got a bonus costume. I'm going to keep her in her regular one because I'm not really digging this one too much. And he's got... Uh, I'll just keep him in this one because I like all the color variations and the gold looks really cool. And over here he's just... I don't know. He's like a vampire mixed with Papa Smurf or something. It's a little weird. Um, but it's not bad. But I do prefer the regular costume. He, he actually looks like a completely different person. If you look at his face and hair, like it just looks like a new character in a sense compared to this. This is the regular one. So I'll stick with the regular. Um, let's go ahead. Uh, red hair, we've been rocking out with you. Let's go ahead and put Slipnir back on for the speed. So we are a foot and fist team. Let's go ahead and uh, fix that to foot and, uh, foot and fisting, huh? Um... Boom, Sal P. Uh, who else can... Wow, Lubu, that's not bad. 5, 1, and 4. It's not actually not bad at all. Um, it's expected, too. To be honest with you. Um, who else could give us 5, 1, 4 juice? I suppose she could. That's fine with me. We got 14% abilities. Uh, special team combinations. Oh, yeah, I haven't really messed around with this. 
I'll fool around with this later another time when I feel like figuring it out. I would like to get all the characters first and then I'll either do this online or never do it at all. <laughs> so let's go ahead and jump in. A Treacherous God, uh, Kanbei, Kuroda, and Zhang Hui are still following Odin. Read the intent of Kanbei, Kuroda, and defeat Loki. So uh, we need to defeat 400 enemies with Unity Magic. Win without Zhang Hui's health falling below 70%. Defeat Sun Wukong within seven minutes. Let's see if we can pull that off. レンゴン軍はケラウノスを奪ったロキの元に向かう。ロキ、かつてのペルセウスに真田 ペルセウス殿として過ごした時間の全てがぶつかり合うのは必要。友であればこそ ロキもそういう思いだといいんだけどね。良いのです。私が伝えたいだけですから。では、参りましょう。ゼウスとの伸びきを取り戻すため。うん。Okay. Mm, oh shit. Dude, look at all those. I hope they're not all monsters. Damn it, man. Well, okay, a couple of them are. Dude, this mission is gonna be crazy cool. Look at all those enemies. I wanna pull every single enemy over there into just one big ball and just hit them with every freaking thing I have. Uh, Zhang Hui, where is Sun Wukong anyway? He's there. Okay, so I gotta get there within seven minutes to feed him. And I need uh, unity kills. And where is uh, Zhang Hui? I don't see you okay oh he's an enemy at the moment so he's gonna definitely they're gonna clearly they're gonna betray and join us soon um, okay 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 let's go ahead did I put those on my thingy I did All right, let's go ahead and jump on in so actually let's go uh, let's, let's kick some butt here shall we oh ah. <laughs> Sidewinder, how's it going, buddy? So right now I have no idea what I should be doing. Ant's head get eliminated. The sin, the sin, her single target abilities are just freaking legendary. Uh, so let's go ahead and defeat this person up here. And don't worry, whatever attacks we miss out in the battle, uh, as usual, we will get to check them out in the real uh, thing link thing. Let's go ahead and defeat this Chaos Legion real quick, too. 
Let's go ahead and blow it up with one of these. Yeah, that was interesting. And I got my divine power. I walked right into your trap. We've walked right into our trap. Huh? Excuse me? Who walked into... Did you walk into your own trap? I hit this guy, damn it. <laughs> You've walked into your own trap, eh? <laughs> This. Damn it, where is it? I can't see it. Oh, no. Okay, we're powered up. Oh, he ran into it this time. That, I don't understand. Now he ran into it on his own. I couldn't even see that. Alright. So, being electric... Hold on a second. Pull this back. Did I have a time limit down there? It looked like I had a time limit. I'm unsure, actually. Um, but I do know that they wanted me to continue down this path. Let's go ahead and keep going. Defeat that. Oh, wait, never mind. Scratch that. Chan uh, plans have changed drastically. What in tarnation? Uh, looks like we're heading up north. We may or may not be able to defeat... Uh, to Mukong within seven minutes. I need to get up there and do some juice. That's what I have to do. Can I go this way? I think it'll be faster. See if I can go this way over here. When we get up there, we're gonna Unity Magic that entire group. Just to get her eliminated as quick as possible. I'm on my way. Don't worry, I'm on my way. Ah, uh, who's got their Unity Magic buffed? You do. Let's go ahead and do this one. And let's do this here. We got the squad out here looking nice. Uh, nice explosion for you guys. Chaos Legion should die. And let's go do the uh, unique magic on this girl too. Oh yeah, that looked that looked cool. Oh, get that blade to the throat, my lady. He's blocked off. It looks like we have to go up through this way. When I play this stage, I feel like I always have to come this path. Alright, let's go ahead and buff myself. Alright. That laser. Not bad. Not bad at all. Now let's go over here and drop my thing because it's going to expire soon. And let's drop that. Let's eat this new one. Okay. Alright, let's go head on forward. Lightyear is going to help us. I'm definitely uh, noticing the damage difference here, man. I don't know about you guys, but I'm definitely seeing it. I'm feeling it too. Like, look at this. It's kind of ridiculous, actually. Let's go ahead and blow this room up as well. Hopefully it kills the Chaos Legion with it. Usually it hits the entire room, so it should kill the Chaos Legion in this case. Uh, if it doesn't, well, sucks to be me. Alright, so it did die. Boy, you just got teleported through. You just got absolutely bamboozled. Oh, I didn't get a divine power. I thought I did. Let's go ahead and defeat Sun Wukong now. We got two minutes. Oh my god. Look at all of this shit. Oh my god. I'm gonna have... I'm gonna have such a great time in this area. Where is Sun Wukong? Where are you? I'm going for you now. I'm gonna have such a good fucking time in that room. Um, so first, let's go ahead and delete this thing. Boom. Uh, was Sun Wukong defeated? No, he was not. I mean, you guys can get that work there. Alright, now... I am hoping 
That hers is fucking legendary. Please give me some good shit. Please, please, please give me. Oh! Oh, baby! Oh! She is giving me that good shit. Damn it, it ends here. Do this. Do this. Yes, we got the 300 hit. And now we need. That's right, I, keep, I forgot I need unity kills. What am I doing? I'm insane. Holy shit, it almost... I think the game almost... I literally feel like the game almost crashed. Uh, right there. I had him pop one of these. Wow, we got the 400 kills, dude. <laughs> we got the freaking 400 kills there. Alright, let's go ahead. Uh, how's Zhang Wei's health doing? He's up there. Let's go save him first before anything else. Excuse me, Copperhead. Man, this stage. That was pretty. That was awesome. Let's go ahead and blow him up with a unique magic stripe leg. I have a two piece, dude. I have a one piece into EX, you fool. <laughs> now give me your shit. Got some gems from your from your dead body. Uh now let's have some fun with the god himself. Where are where are your parents? Give me your copperhead. And I am powered up. He grabs you and tosses you. Oh my, okay. Open the gates. Open the gates, please. Yes! Oh, come on. My magic wore off. Right, let me go ahead and power up again. Oh, you're gonna get it, Griffin. You're gonna get fucking duty down. That is one Griffin down. There should be one on the other side. I'm gonna run up and just press triangle and just see how much damage my electricity is gonna do. Just block. Right. So, Zeus definitely. He's not the best god. Um. But he, he's unique. He's got his own juice here. It's pretty interesting. I still don't like the idea of RNG on his ability. Uh, Zhang Hui. Oh! Go with Zhang Hui. Go with Zhang Hui. That is the one we follow indefinitely. I still don't like that his ability is RNG, but I do like that his unique magic can help with that. You know, it's pretty much like Athena's unique magic, where uh, her unique magic, what it does is empowers all her abilities. His does exactly the same thing. And to have that guaranteed, uh, you know, to have the guaranteed way to attain it is fantastic. And we're just still blowing people up. Like, this is his basic attacks, just doing all this. Keep in mind, he does have brilliance on. So, let's go blow this room up. I'm confident we could build one more up before Loki's here. Um, and then after this, we do have to check out Shangong and Wang Yi's abilities. And, uh... And, uh, what is it? Uh, mock battle, you know? So, definitely... Gotta keep an eye out for that. Getting body slammed, dude. Oh, -ho! where is uh, where is V? Can I target? Oh my God! Look at that. You can just cheese somebody. I remember cheesing someone in, uh, in Empires. And then being able to freeze them is overpowered with it, too. Uh... Is he dead? It would appear so. Hello? Let's do an aerial muso attack here. Damn, boy. Oh! Oh, my neck! 
He's, he's just frozen, it'll be fine. So we weren't able to get a new singling thing, but that's okay. Um, let's go, who am I locked onto? There's an invisible griffin here, it must be inside the room. Yep, invisible griffin. Pull that back onto me, and your griffin is now dead, buddy. Oh, <laughs> that uppercut! <laughs> that uppercut destroyed this dude! Oh man, what were my objectives? Protect the guy, defeat Sun Wukong in 7, and Unity. I think we're good. We should have, we have everything. I can't believe that uh, he died to an uppercut. That dude could not handle that Ryu. That Ryukin, baby. Man, I need more growth points. How was it? Fighting Loki. ロキと Awesome, we're getting two new characters. Dashkuni. この a general at a very young age. Considered Dung Ai as his rival. Oh, really? So that Ash and Gary kind of thing, huh? Extremely talented. He was not trusted by older generals due to his overconfidence. <laughs> Kanbei, the terrifying strategist. Boom. Oh, no, we were too slow. A whole minute too slow. But we got all the objectives. So screw it, man. I'm not upset. And we just barely got the S-Class kill. Uh, growth points, 50,000. I'll take that. Yeah, damn right, baby. Four star. Ooh. You see how the three and the... This was what I wanted to talk about. You see how the four and the three star look exactly the same up there? It's really hard to tell when you have a better weapon. And this being a four star, it has the same exact attack strength as that three star. I don't know if that three star is above average. I don't know if this four star is absolute trash. It's just hard to really tell, you know? It, that's where, kind of where they drop the ball. Make the weapons look different. I'm probably deleting five stars sometimes because they just look the same as a three star. And that's just uh, something they should work on in the future. They'll probably sell it to us as DLC, which I'm not looking forward to. Uh, but yeah, it is what it is, you know? And we got to check out some Wang Yi. I don't think we played at her as all, uh, as all, at all in this playthrough. I bet they're gonna throw a damn side mission at me soon. The Serpent King to start with. Okay. Okay. 
欲しくはそれを倒した者と戦おうとするはずうん赤い神を倒せばユグドラシルの先生を阻止できる you guys wanna give it a shot. 試してみる価値はありそうだな、okay. うん、よろしく頼むぞオロチ Do we have to fight again? So, those of you that played Wars Orochi 3 Ultimate, you already know why the Mystics are kind of like Orochi, man. Do we really have to fight? Because、uh, in that game, they revealed who Orochi was.、Um, he, was he, usually, he used to be a Mystic called Yinglong. That's why Yinglong and Orochi look extremely similar.、Um, let me, I just want to take a peek at who, who they want me to use. Oh, wow. A totally. Level one team. Sadly, I'm gonna have to switch someone out. I can probably level two of these guys to 15 to get all their abilities, and then the third person's just gonna have to go.、Um, I can't I can't with three level 10s. That's gonna be tough. Maybe I'll be able to do it, but we won't have all their abilities unlocked. And I think that's the biggest thing is、uh, having the abilities unlocked. For this fight, I kind of. You know what? I'll swap out、uh, Kanbe. I kind of want to play as Munanori. And John Quay, I just, it's been a while since I tried him out.、Um, but before we get in there, let's go ahead and check out、uh, Shen Gong and、uh, Wang Yi's abilities in a mock battle.、Um, and we'll just see how that goes for us. And I guess we'll just call it a day、uh, after we're done here. So Zeus,、uh, Zeus overall,、uh, when he's not electrified, I think he's absolute trash. He shines the. When, when he's not electrified, he's bad. When he is electrified, He's above average. He's nowhere near what Athena can do. And then when she uses her charge magic, first of all, she's a monster to begin with. You give her that charge magic, who can stop her? Nobody can stop her with that, that new、uh, her EX charge magic. Zeus, on the other hand, he is bad to start off with. When he's electrified, he becomes decent, but still nowhere near what Athena's doing.、Um, is Zeus as good as Ares or worse? Hmm. I don't know what, how I feel about both of them.、Uh, I love the character designs, I'll say that. But I don't think. I think Zeus may actually be below Ares.、Um, when it comes to magic, I definitely like Zeus's magic better than, than Ares. But I feel like Ares' regular attacks are superior to Zeus's, even when he's empowered attacks.、Um, if you're looking for someone that's really strong, basic attack wise. Then Zeus would be stronger than Ares in that aspect.、Um, I don't know. You know what? It's kind of a tie. And just because he can empower himself, I can guarantee it with the charge magic. Just because of that, I personally consider Zeus better than Ares. Just because he, that charge attack, I can guarantee it with the charge magic. And by the, by the time it expires, I can get a new one. So that's why I think he's better than Ares. Ares, I just wasn't really digging none of the stuff he brought,、uh, even for his magic as well. So、um, let's go ahead and check out Shen Gong.、Uh, he's got a no biscuit and a four piece.、Uh, let's check out the aerial charge attack. He slams a little boot on the ground. Pretty damn cool, pretty decent range. I think he has reach on this weapon, does he? He does have reach, so reach, bam. That, that is awesome. That reach is.、Uh, Affecting everything, not just your basic abilities, so that's quite nice.、Um, that might have been something they added new for this game because I remember in previous games I'll have reach on my weapons and my jumping charge attack, things like that nature,、uh, of that nature would not benefit from it. So the fact that it does here makes reach all that more important for your characters, in my opinion. So it appears, anyway.、Uh, jumping basic attack, but the jumping charge, damn good. It's even. It's, It hits more people than some characters' Muso attacks.、Uh, let's go ahead and check out、uh, all the basic attacks here.、Uh, and he has. Yeah. Alright, let's check out the first EX. He reads a scroll, and some archers pop out and shoot you, and he just kind of sits there. He's a, he's a funny character, but he can kick your ass in the meantime when those archers are there for a little bit. Um, one piece. A little soldier pops out and slices you. Two piece. I don't think we got to see it too well.、So、another soldier comes out and chops everyone up. Three piece. Two spearmen? 
four piece. They knock you up and they just really just beat your ass, essentially. And then five piece, the shield dudes come out and whoop you down. <laughs> He's a funny character, I like him. Uh, let's check out regular Musou attack. Man, imagine being a general getting chopped down by one of these Shengong troops. Would you be salty or what? Aerial Musou attack? Boom. And now we have the, uh, let's wait for more minions to spawn. Now we do the Raging Musou attack. Man, I was really hoping that area where I used uh, Wang Yi. Oh, this is another good one. I was really hoping there'd have been more soldiers around so I can get like a thousand kills just in that area, maybe even more. <laughs> and now, uh, last but not least, check out the uh, unique magic where he summons more soldiers. And they just kick your ass again. He just he just has soldiers all day to just beat your ass. So now we will go ahead and check out uh, Wang Yi. This is the new weapon she had attained in Dynasty Warriors 8 Empires. Uh, the uh, May Piercers, I think they're called. Um, so she has a one-piece chicken wing and a three-piece. We'll go ahead and check out the jumping charge. Oh, look at that shit. She, she isn't... This is like... If you're making an Assassin's Creed character, this is your, this is the move set you do in Dynasty Warriors: Eight Empires. Um, in Dynasty Warriors Nine, she, I think she lost this weapon. I believe I don't even remember what she has in there anymore. But the jumping charge attack, super unique, super cool. Stabs you in the back. Oh, it doesn't feel too good, does it? Uh, jumping basic attack. Uh, let's check out the basic attack string. Check it out again. All right, now we'll go ahead and check out just triangle button. That's the one that you can kind of spam it, and if they're frozen, you can pretty much stab the same person over and over as you guys saw um, when I was abusing it on that one officer. Yeah, he's getting stabbed a couple times, so you can just keep doing it. And if you wanted to, you really could spam that and cheese kill them. Um, so that's just regular triangle right there. Let's go ahead and check out the... Um, one piece chicken wing into EX, which is really cool. Very flashy looking. I always thought the moveset on this thing was very cool and like unique. No one has these cool assassin moves and it really gave, and I and at the time when this uh, moveset came out, I was really loving Assassin's Creed games. Uh, not so much right now because they don't feel like Assassin's Creed games anymore. They just feel like a brawler. Um, but yeah, when they when this came out, I was really loving it. Uh, so what what did we just see? The oh, the, now it's the two piece. So what we had seen was the uh, one piece into EX, and now the two piece. Oh, whoops. The two piece. She kind of dances around you. She does that. She could do this before you fall to the ground, even without the ice on eight empires. I remember you could. Um, and then three-piece chicken wing to kick to the face. And then four-piece chicken wing. Actually, which one was that? Oh, hold on, hold on. Yeah, that's a three-piece, okay. That's the four-piece. It's kind of hard to see which one is which. So one piece again. Two piece again. Oh, I just is that the three piece? It is her three piece, the thingling thing. That is the four piece. And the five piece. Okay. Um, now we just have uh, her Musou attack spawn me more people, please. So let's try it out. Alright, Musou attack, regular Musou attack. It's actually awesome. Her regular Musou attack is actually amazing. 
I love the animation. I love the stuff that's happening to the people. She's just dashing through you. This is such a ninja move set. Like, this is so, like... If Assassin's Creed turned into a Musou game, I'd imagine this is the shit you'd be doing to, to people. You know, like, look at this, this Musou attack is awesome. I love it. I love this Musou attack. I'm really having fun with this uh, moveset in general. I just wish it had more wave clear. Um, so let's check out the aerial Musou attack as well. Interesting. I still prefer the regular Musou attack to that one. I just think this is... This is awesome. It even broke the game. I'm looking under the ground there. So, uh... And then they fall in slow motion, so look at that. That regular Musou attack is kind of overpowered. Uh, let's go ahead and check out the Raging Musou attack. We had seen it once already in, the, in, the, in this episode. So let's check it out one more again. It was a good one. Luckily, we had two characters that had great uh, Raging. Look at this thing. They actually made Wang Yi pretty freaking good. And then she does a little dance. Makes a little love and then stabs you right in the butt. Uh, and then last but not least, we get to check out the unique magic. Which we we have seen a couple times. Personally, not too impressed, but for unique magic. Um, I, I, don't, I don't even know if the magic they gave her suits her. To be honest with you. I don't know. This works fine. I don't know what would have been good for her. But I don't think... Think that this spammable what we're using uh we're using the Hades variation. But I don't think Dine Slife is really something that suits her, if that makes sense. Well I mean I guess they're giving Dine Slife to the people that have a lot of hatred in their heart. You think that's what it is? Orochi has it as well. I'm not sure. So guys, that is gonna be it for this one. Thanks for watching. And uh, hopefully I'll catch you all next time. And until then, see ya.